Hello everyone, this is Leo. Well, trying to help a friend to set up a Devo 7 for a Runner 250. I decided to do this video log so that I could share with everyone. As you could see, the Devo 7 doesn't have a USB port. So you could either beam the profile to another transmitter and get a copy of it, or you could just manually set it up. So let's move on to the quick start guide. As you could see on section 9.2, there's a whole paragraph dedicated to setting up the Devo 7 on the runner 250. On the right is the enter button, which is a step in, and on the left is the exit button, a step out. And the two extreme left and right buttons are the left and right, and scrolling up and down. One of the first things you'll probably do is to make a copy, a backup of your original factory model profile and you do that by copying the source and putting it into a destination a new open slot so that's what we're doing the destination is mod 3 uh, open slot 3 and say yes and that will save it and made a copy so now I have two copies of the runner um, if you don't have a copy to make then we just start a brand new one and name it runner so the first thing you would do is to select the type for this model and it is a really common mistake to set quadcopter to a heli but in actual fact a quadcopter is not a helicopter it is model over over a aeroplane so arrow would be the correct selection We now move on to the most important part, which is the outputs. The outputs determine the switches. So for the flight mode switch, you have to assign it to gears. So for gears, set it up as flight mode and active. Then we have next the mix switch or the gear switch set to flaps. Either one is fine, but according to the user guide, the gears are set to flaps. And lastly, auxiliary, which has to be set to auxiliary 2. Auxiliary 2, 2, auxiliary 2, and active. We now exit out and move over to the function menu. What we do next is to look at the reverse switches, also those. No need to change any of them, they are all normal, but let's scroll down and take a look at all the switches. They should be normal and not reversed. We take a look at the wing setting. There is no need to change anything, it should be normal. Let's take a quick look and that's normal and that sums it all up. We are all ready to go. The motor profile for the Renault 250 is set up. And now a short preview of some of our recent FPV projects for the Missing Children Network. 